Oh my god, it's 420! It's 420! I can't believe it! Oh, oh, I can do some weed. Ah, yes. Wait. I can't smoke weed alone. Hmm. Even if it's through a phone, at least, I need someone to just do it with me. <sighs> Who can do it with me? Shrek 2 is literally the best game ever made. So fun. <gasps> oh, I know. I'll call Justin. Let me see if he'll be interested. Yo, Justin. What's up, man? Hey, Tony. How's it going? You know what today is, man? Um... April 20th? Yes! But what do people do on April 20th? April 20th. April 20th. April 20th. Oh, that's right. It's 420! There you go, man! There you go! You want to do some weed with me right now? Heck yeah, man, I do! Damn! It's Friday night, so everything is popping. I got skin to spin on the hand. Hey there, everybody. This is 22 Tiger Dude here, and in celebration of 420, me and Justin Watch's movies are going to be reviewing the movie Friday. So, Friday is directed by F. Gary Gray. The film is written by Ice Cube and DJ Pooh. And the film stars Ice Cube and Chris Tucker. So, Friday tells the story of Craig and Smokey, who are just enjoying a nice Friday after when Craig wakes up seeing that he lost his job and he has nothing to do on Friday. So, with the help of his buddy Smokey, they enjoy a nice little Friday afternoon and they smoke weed. They just sit on Craig's porch, look at all the beautiful ladies, until when they get into a situation. So before I review Friday, my guest star, Justin Watches Movies, is going to be reviewing this film. So Justin, take it away. Hey everybody on 22 Tiger Dudes channel, I'm Justin from Justin Watches Movies. I'm here today to discuss Friday on 420. This movie stars Ice Cube and Chris Tucker, and it honestly took me a few years to really see this movie because I'm someone who does not partake in the weed lifestyle. I never have, and I don't think I ever will. And so it took me some years to really get into this movie and really watch it because I was against that lifestyle for like a long period of time. And so it took me until like college to really watch this movie. And I found a lot of enjoyment in Friday, and that's mainly due to the fact of the main leads of Ice Cube and Chris Tucker. I do think they have amazing, amazing chemistry, and it really feels like a natural friendship. They do provide a lot of laughs in this movie when they are interacting with each other. And another thing I really do appreciate about this movie is the pacing of this movie. It is a very chilled, relaxed film. It's not very fast. It's not slow, it has a nice calm pace to it. And I think the reason for doing that is because people who are watching this movie are probably going to be high and they don't want to have something where they have to really pay attention to. They want to sit back, relax, have fun. And that's why I think the pacing works really well with this film because it does have a really chilled, relaxing pace to it. And it makes the movie really enjoyable and feel realistic that these people are just hanging out on Friday, things are happening, and that's just a lie. I really do appreciate the pacing because I can sit back, I can really enjoy it and not have to really think about it too much. Just have fun with it. Plus, the main leads are really funny. There's a lot of funny moments in here. A lot of one-liners that are hilarious. And I've grown to appreciate this movie over the years. It's nothing that I can relate to, but the leads are very charismatic. The chemistry is great. The pacing is really well done. And overall, it is a really funny film. I'm gonna go ahead and give Friday a B. Have you guys seen Friday? What do you think about it? 22 Tiger Dude, thank you for allowing me to be on your channel to discuss this movie with you. I hope everybody enjoys 420 if you do do that stuff i hope you enjoy it 22 tiger dude has it and i have it and that is tag of power thank you so much justin for reviewing friday 
Friday is a hilarious comedy. I think this movie is an absolute blast to watch. And the reason Friday is such a memorable comedy is because of how sharp the writing is, how great the direction is, and how memorable these characters are, specifically the two leads played by Ice Cube and Chris Tucker. Friday is honestly the perfect film to watch on a day like 420. Now, I don't celebrate 420. I don't do weed and all that. So I can't necessarily relate to the characters in this film that do weed, but it is still very entertaining to see these characters just get high and smoke weed and have a conversation on Craig's porch. Ice Cube and DJ Pooh knew how to handle the script and they did such a great job of writing the script. It's very well written and it's because of how clever the writing is. The movie honestly doesn't get boring. It moves at a nice pace. It doesn't overstay its welcome, which I do really appreciate. Ice Cube and Chris Tucker, they're fantastic here. Man, do you just buy that these two are just best buds wanting to hang out. And it's because of how great these two were in this film that their chemistry definitely works 100%. And I thought the characters, Craig and Smokey in general, they're just very memorable characters that I just really loved following. They're very entertaining, they're very funny, but they're also aware of how dangerous the hood is. And there's a lot of exploration of how dangerous the hood can be, which I thought was handled very well for this film. And F. Gary Gray does a great job directing this film. He knows how to take a simple concept Sip like Friday and the way he directs this film he still does such a great job of really taking you in this world the world of these two guys that are enjoying a nice Friday smoking weed and sitting on the porch not only are Ice Cube and Chris Tucker really great here they are the standouts for sure but the other performances I think are pretty good especially Craig's father played by John Witherspoon I believe that's the actor's name He's great in this film. He's so funny. At the same time though, he is just a very caring father that just wants to look out for his son. One of the best scenes on Friday is actually one of the more honest scenes of this film when Craig's father is talking to Craig about being a man and how you don't need a gun to defend yourself. That was actually one of the best scenes on Friday. And it's not even a funny scene, it's a very honest, genuine scene. And that's something I appreciate about Friday. A lot of the movie is definitely very funny. A lot of the things that characters say or a lot of the things that characters do, they're very funny. But there are a few times where the movie does get more serious, where it does get more honest. And when the movie does go for more of the honest approach, it honestly does work very well. The movie definitely gets more serious when you get to the final act because of a situation that Craig and Smokey get in, but they really never go away from the comedy route. They still add plenty of comedy, but when the movie gets serious for a little bit, it doesn't really distract me. The shift in tone doesn't distract me. I think it worked in the direction that they wanted to go. I also have to say that the soundtrack in Friday is terrific here too. I love the soundtrack. I think any kind of music that plays in this film, it never feels out of place. And it's very consistent with its comedy. There are so many times where I'm busting out laughing watching Friday because the comedy is just so consistent. Even if you don't do weed, you could still laugh at the weed humor that Friday provides because of how well executed those scenes are. And just the movie handling the concept of us seeing what these characters are doing and the span of one entire day, I thought it was handled very well. Now the only problems I was able to find with Friday, and there's really only a couple, I don't have a lot of flaws with this film personally, just a few times the humor didn't work, and it really is just a few times. And the movie does have some characters that don't really have to be in 
in this film like it really wouldn't be much of a difference if some of the characters that appeared weren't in this film because they didn't really serve that much of a purpose some of them are just added there for comic relief like you only see Bernie Mac for like a scene in this film which is cool to see Bernie Mac and that scene dealing with him and Tony Cox who does appear in this film too for a few scenes that scene was definitely very funny and don't get me wrong I was laughing so it's not like it's a major issue with me but I couldn't help but feel that yeah the characters are just there to add comic relief but don't really add much of a purpose to the story as a whole there's this character named Felicia hence the whole famous by Felicia line. You know, Felicia, I didn't care for her. I didn't care for Craig's girlfriend either. I actually thought she was quite annoying. Overall, Friday is a great comedy that has sharp writing, great direction, really great performances. The movie has great cinematography too. I forgot to mention that. It has a great soundtrack and it's a movie that doesn't overstay its welcome. I'm gonna give Friday three and a half out of four stars. So you guys in the comments down below, let me know what you think about Friday. And I'll also have to thank Justin Watches Movies for coming here to review Friday. And last year on 420, we both actually did review the Pineapple Express together. So if you guys do want to check out our review that we did last year for 420, I will leave a link to the video in the outro, which will show up in a sec. Link to Justin's channel is in the description down below. I highly recommend it. This is 20 Tiger Dude here. And don't forget that I will always have Tiger power! Damn! So let the games begin! Yakety yak! Don't talk back to a song! Calling up Earl on the car phone! Mac 10 just got out of court! Bowling through the hood in the super sport! Dropping too short!